what we do here is go back, 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 back. back. Follow that faded sign by the side of the road that says 15 miles to the love shack. Coming to us from the Arctic Figure Skating Club, here is Pauline Bynum. I started taking my hair off, hair off, hair out, <laughs> but I realized I have not vlogged at all today. Um, so this morning woke up, got ready looking like this, and skated my light program. I skated it great. It was a really clean, over the top <laughs> program, and I got ninth, which is really good because I was the last person to skate. So you know, the odds of just coming in last when you skate last are very high because they run out of placements and I understand. But they really liked it and I got ninth and I think I had like a seven in there, two, I don't know. The numbers were all over the place, but people seemed to really enjoy the program and I had fun and that's all that matters. Um, then we went to Starbucks, then we went back to the rink and watched our coach Deanna. She did a Shakespeare program. It was so funny. It was so good. She had like a full on like half bald, half hair wig thing going on and a beard and a mustache and it was, it was over the top. It was great. I loved it. Um, and then now we're back at the hotel room in the process of changing for our duet. So I'm going to have to remove the green eyeshadow but carefully leave my eyeliner, take off the lips, completely redo the hair. I started taking it out. It's starting to fall flat now. Um, do two, we're gonna do two buns that because we have a headband with ears on it because we're lemurs and then we can attach it so the 
ears to the buns. Yes. We're skating too. I like to move it, move it. So that'll be very fun and I will see you when I look completely different. We're all done. We don't know how we placed yet, but we were eighth to skate. Eighth to skate out of nine in our group. We made people laugh. I heard some laughs. Yeah, and we got pictures on the podium. We will try to get pictures outside, but it is 90 degrees and we're wearing furry suits and we're sweating in an ice rink, let alone outside 90 degree weather. So yeah, that's all I have. Okay, bye. So evidently there's baby morning doves and I'm trying to find them. Oh my God, they're quail. They're quails. Quails. Good morning. It's the next day. It's Sunday. It's the last day of the competition. Like officially, we don't have to compete anymore. We were done yesterday. So we have today completely off. So that means we have to pack. I'm probably gonna go to the gym. I'm gonna finish this iced chai latte I made, which is delicious. Also, Descendants 3 premiered Thursday, Friday night or something. And we were really busy, so we didn't get to watch it, but it's showing again tonight at 8 p.m. on the Disney Channel in our hotel room. So fingers crossed that we get ready for bed soon enough so that we can just watch it while we're asleep. Because we do need to start going to bed earlier because 8 p.m. here is 8, 9, 10, 11 p.m. at home. So, you know, when we've been staying up till like 11 p.m. here, which is the next day back home. And then Monday, our ride leaves like 8 a.m. So we'll probably want to get up at 6, which sounds early here, but that's 9 a.m. home. So I tried to get up earlier today, but I couldn't do it. <laughs> I stayed up too late. Hopefully I can like cut off caffeine after noon. Just no more caffeinated objects at all. Not even chocolate, not even sugar, none of it. Pass out watching The Descendants. That's our goal. I'll keep you in the loop of our Sunday shenanigans and see what we end up doing today. The airport will probably be more entertaining tomorrow because we have to get there. We'll probably get there very early. It's a three hour drive, so we made it so we can get there very early in case we hit any traffic. So there was a change of plans because um, I had severe cramps shortly after that first video clip I recorded this morning. So I just stayed in my pajamas and very slowly I finished packing. So we got that done at least. And I got dressed in my workout outfit so if later I feel like going to the gym and my Advil kicks in and gets rid of my cramps, I have the option. But we are big outing. We went to Target and Starbucks, not Target. Albertsons. It's the grocery store, their version of Kroger basically here, right by Target. Got pads <laughs> and Funyuns, so. But now we're sitting in the lobby and I have to show you, they have the prettiest and warmest little fireplace. Look at it, you can even see May's reflection in it. It's so pretty. Hey May. Hey May. May.
Thank you.